Hi everyone. Hi, welcome back to GMB's Corner. Um, I am B's mom. Hi. So I thought I would do a review on Popeye's the ghost pepper wings. Um, just to let you know that the times that I have gone to Popeye's to go get these wings or order these wings, they never have them. Um, they're always sold out. So today I went ahead and went um, right after work. And um, unfortunately I had to wait 10 minutes um, for them to um, not only cook, you know, the rest of my order, which I ordered tenders for my son. And um, I also ordered the raspberry cheesecake pies. Okay, so I was kind of like excited. I wanted to try these. I've been curious to try these ghost pepper wings. So um, I'm happy. Unfortunately, now that I open up the, you know, the lid, um, they're pretty small. Look at how small they are. They're not like, you know, for a company that, you know, that's all they do is cook chicken. You know, they, they specialize in chicken. These are small wings. Um, wing stop, um, their wings are much bigger. You know, um, I'm kind of surprised that they are small and it doesn't seem like too much meat. Um, a lot of crunch. You can see, you know, like how cr crunchy it is. Sorry. But yeah, so that's the size is disappointing. And um, I did order um, a side of red beans and rice. I don't see it in here. They forgot it. Um, unfortunately, this particular Popeyes, um, you sometimes they don't have a lot of menu items available, or you know, unfortunately, um, they forget you know the rest of my order. And then I found out today that they no longer carry corn on the cob, which I thought was really strange. So, but yet they have it on the menu through the drive-through. So um, that's a little disappointing. Um, I went ahead and tried one already. So again, you can see the crunch. Okay, I'm not going to try it because I'm probably going to start coughing. They are spicy. Okay, not a whole lot. You bite into it, it has a good flavor, but then the spiciness will kick in. And then I started coughing and I had a little coughing fit. So I won't bite into it, but you can see, you know, they are juicy, a lot of crunch. They are good. But just have your drink ready and on the side. Um, yeah, I was turning red too, but they are very good. Um, actually, I'll go ahead and um, take another bite. But um, if I start coughing, you know, please excuse me. But um, I, there's a lot of crunch. You know, whoops, I keep going off camera. But there is a lot of crunch. Oh, so pretty good. Oops. Pretty good. The spice is beginning to kick in the more you chew. Mm -hmm. Ooh. So they are good. Just have your drink on, you know, ready on standby. <laughs> but they are pretty good. And I feel like I'm turning red, I'm a little bit redder, but very good. Again, and very small. So, um, personally, I think this box, I can't remember how much it was. It was probably about $7, maybe $8. I think this could be a $5 box. Um, again, um, the wings are very small, you know, and, um, even though it has a lot of crunch and there's some juice in there, um, from the chicken, it kind of seems like the chicken has been sitting under a heat lamp for a while. So they don't really look that fresh, but they're still good. Um, I really enjoy um, Popeye's chicken very much. And like I said, I was curious to try these ghost pepper wings. So they, they're pretty good. Um, just, you know, go try them. Um, the only thing is, is that, you know, the size is, you know, pretty small. Um, unlike, you know, places like at Wingstop. But um, go and try it and um, it does have a kick to it. You know, they are very good. But um, go and try it. And again, this is at Popeye's the Ghost Pepper Wings. Okay. Thank you. Bye.